complete combustion of ethanol. Complete combustion involves taking your initial reactant, that's C5, C2H5OH, which is a liquid at room temperature, and reacting it with oxygen gas. That's what combustion means. The word complete here means you're gonna make the fully oxidized versions of carbon and hydrogen. For carbon, it's carbon dioxide, always. And for hydrogen, it's water. I like gas phase water because combusting or burning things makes things hot, so it's probably steam that comes out. This is it for the unbalanced complete combustion of ethanol. Balancing it might pose a problem, but let's try it together anyways, yeah? Two carbons here, I need two carbons on the right. There you go. Six hydrogens, there's five and one, which makes six. They come in pairs, so I'm only gonna need three over here, okay? Now oxygens, I have four of them here, and three of them here, that's seven oxygens on the right. I've already got one here, so I only need six oxygens in this chunk here. See, seven on the right, but you already have one on the left, and you're controlling the number in front of this, and you need six total. Thankfully, six is divisible by two, so you only need three of these pairs to make the six. Oh, look, that's it. No fractions needed. Balanced whole number coefficients. Complete combustion. Combustion tells you that you're reacting with oxygen, and complete means you're not making any other byproducts like carbon monoxide or soot. Carbon dioxide and water only. Best of luck.